I'm John Green. I'm a printmaker and an artist, originally from the Philadelphia area. I, I found printmaking at, in undergraduate school. Um, generally, I think I am a process-oriented person. I'm someone who really appreciates craft, uh, but I really had a lot of things to say. And printmaking, it's, you know, comes from a history of giving information to the masses. I, I feel as though art has like become a lifestyle. My first printmaking class I actually got a C plus in and uh, my, my professor at the end of the uh, semester she came up to me and she said you do a really good job of fitting the role of an artist and I just have to put the work in and then I started really putting the work in. <laughs> All of my prints relate to my experiences in psychoanalysis basically from birth until I was a senior in high school I was employed in psychoanalysis so five days a week for um, at least 45 minutes a day, I was sitting with a Freudian psychoanalyst. But I, I started to discover that the boundaries I was creating really referenced the room I was sitting in and the experiences I had as like, a young kid. For me, it's definitely part of my existence to be aware of my mental state, almost to a, a fault. So um, I think my prints often can like show what I'm thinking better than I can say. The imagery from my prints and my installations largely comes from architecture around me. Um, a lot of it is actually concept first, so I'll think about like psychological experiences I've had, um, moments where I've witnessed a boundary of some kind or another, and I'll look for textures, I'll look for elements in architecture in nature or you know, in building areas, in cities, and manipulate a composition to fit those found objects or found textures. I, I definitely believe as an instructor, as um, now a professor, that the, like, the goal in printmaking is to teach the techniques and teach them in a way that expands the mind so that there's potential for you know, someone creating their own path in printmaking. Uh, I think that intaglio should exist. I think lithography should exist. I think we should try to find ways to make them more sustainable and you know, safer. I think we should acknowledge uh, technology in print, but I think that it's important to learn craft, learn how to tear paper, learn um, how to fit two pieces of mylar so that they register properly. I think all those things can translate to other parts of the art field and also just like keeping a tight and beautiful practice.